Welcome back to our channel. In today's tutorial, we are going to explore how to add roles in Mango and Mission Miko. Right? Let's start by opening the software. Click on New Project to begin a new project and choose a background that goes well with your project's theme. Once you have your background set, the next step is to add characters and make them come to life. Exciting, right? To do this, go to the Roles tab at the upper right corner. Here you will find a bunch of different character options, each serving a different purpose. There are characters that look official, some that are simple and even some that express emotions deeply. And guess what? You can even customize characters to match your vision. This editable roles feature allows you to change how characters look. Plus, there is something called group roles that helps you tell stories better or, or fit your style. Now let's get started with adding roles. I'm going to pick the official role for now. Click on all to see all the official roles available. I will choose the fashion girl character. When you click on any roles, you will get multiple options like uh, walking, talking or sitting. You just have to choose your perfect style for your animation. Right. Now pick a pre-animated action for her. I will choose walk so she moves from right to left. Place her on the right side of the screen. Make her bigger. But we don't need her entrance to be too flashy. Right? So reduce that effect. To make her walk more naturally, extend the timeline for her walking. You can also add move effect by clicking the plus icon. Drag her to where you want her to go. And adjust the move effect to make it look right. Now let's add another character. I will go with the chubby boy. Pick a walking action for him too. Just a heads up. You have to click on the character and then choose an action. It's not a simple drag and drop process. Right? Now make him move so he meets the girl. Maybe they want to talk. Oh, and don't forget to flip the boy horizontally so he faces the right direction. Let's make the boy say hello. Adjust his size to you remember how right right click choose edit and adjust the size Now let's add more actions the girl should look surprised so go to the emotion tab and select the surprised look Remember to increase the timeline since we will be adding more actions. Click on the plus icon and give the boy an explaining action. And again let's adjust his position to make it look natural. Time for another action. The girl should be happy, right? Find the right action for that. Perfect. Adjust the timeline as needed. Let's preview it before publishing.
Now that our characters have done their thing, we can wrap it up. You can publish your project and share it. Thanks for following along and I will catch you in the next tutorial.